Okay, New York's favorite housewives will soon be added again, and there may be <laughs> some new faces added oh. into the mix. Ooh, season six of The Real Housewives of New York will start filming soon. And one of the housewives is revealing a lot more about her family and the life and death struggle they faced. Your kid's going to need a liver transplant was a blow that I'll never forget. Uh, Jax ultimately was uh, put on the liver transplant list at three months old. Sure. Well, joining us this morning is Real Housewife, businesswoman, and advocate Heather Thompson, who's here to tell us how we can help save lives. So, good morning, Heather. Thank Hi you for guys. joining us. How are you? I'm so happy you to be here. Smell. I, I do. Yeah, I tell you, what is that? It's from down, the side. Down, I can smell. It's Tom Ford. Really? It's really? Yeah, that Tom I mean, Ford. Just, I mean, he, got, he doesn't mess around. That's her okay. signature. Take, I'm like taking that. notes right now. Well, well, Tom Ford. Him up a little. You can make his stuff your own. You can give the guys perfume advice, but you're also here to tell us about your son, Jack. And yeah. now tell us, how is he doing now? He's great. Jax is a normal, healthy little kid. I mean, he certainly ebbs and flows. He's got his bumps in the road. He's immunosuppressed still. Uh, he received his transplant at six months old. Mm. So the common cold might wallop sure. him a little harder than us. Mm -hmm. sure. um, but he's doing fantastic. He's our soldier. Awesome. Oh, Are you close to the family that made this possible? Yeah. Very much so. What's I that actually, relationship like? Oh, God, it's, it's bittersweet. There's no other way to describe it than bittersweet. Um, both of our... Uh, Donald Blair was the name of our donor. He was a 25-year-old young man living here in New York City. He actually worked in the fashion industry like me. Oh. Okay. And um, it was just one of those freak accidents and untimely. Yeah. But in his death, he touched over 50 lives and he well, saved my son. Uh, and his parents work in organ donation. Uh, so that was even the most bittersweet. And recently, his mom and I have really started talking. I think earlier on, it was just too hard. I bet. You know what I mean? Sure. But yet, yeah. and I get it. You know. I mean, sure. I really yeah. get it. But he, Donald lives on with us all the time. Yeah. You know, we celebrate his life with Jax's every day. And when I say he touched 50 lives, I really mean it. Not only with his organ donation, but with his t skin and tissue for burn victims. We don't need it when we're gone. Yeah. Right. It's interesting because right. you, you mentioned he touched 50 lives. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So obviously you've become involved with organ donation Very deeply. Much so. But what does one organ donation mean? Just one? Just one? Well, I mean, you can save eight lives completely, not just by touching them, but one person that donates their organs can save eight lives thoroughly wow. between a heart, kidney, pancreas, sure. things like this. Um, the liver actually can divide into two pieces. Really? So part of Don's yeah. liver went to my child and the other part went to a mother. Oh, wow. So you okay. not only touch the life of the actual person who's sick, but what would I be like if I had lost my child? Right. I'd be a different right. person. Right. 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 She right. Sa he saved me too. Well, well you know? Heather, you've been such an advocate and you've just been raising awareness and you've also raised a lot of money for another young boy and yes. his name is Abner. Yes. Can you tell us about oh Abner? My God. So the I believe we have, a, we have a picture yeah, of him as he, well. That's uh, Jack's post-transplant. Oh, that's oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's Jack's six months oh, old. Oh, I do. Oh, I do. <laughs> Yeah. And that was him. He was. He, what happens? They get really big, and then they shrink oh. down to nothing. And he look at his arms. There was nothing to him. Yeah. You know. Yeah. But now so tell us about Abner. Abner is yeah. exactly the same as Jax was. So he had biliary atresia, which is a terrible uh, infant's disease. And um, he was in El Salvador, where they don't even provide transplants. There's no such thing as an organ transplant in El Salvador. So we flew Abner here, and he just had his transplant a week ago. Oh. And oh, nice. his father was the living donor. You wow. can do that with a liver. Right. You can't do that with a heart. You know oh, what I no. mean? Yes. And we don't want to cut into healthy people. Yeah. We need people to donate their organs. God forbid something should happen to them. Sure. But Abner and his father, Hector, are doing amazing. And Kellner Pediatric Liver Foundation, which you saw on the show, yes. right. I did the fundraiser on the show on yep. air. Well, that was real. And that money is what we use to save baby Abner. And we oh. still need help. So go, go to KellnerPediatricLiver.com or you can go to Yummy Life, my website. I'm donating a proceeds of my top selling tank. I have a two pack at Yummy Life right now. I just oh, saw it yesterday. Yes. Yes. We've already sold like over 300 now, since April 1st. Now, and we put it up. He Heather, it's interesting. You talked about the show. We've got to ask you about the show. Yes. I hear rumors about the Countess and Sonia and some of these other folks that may not be coming back. Yeah. Can you yeah. tell us about that? I can confirm who is coming back. Who's That's coming back? Oh, okay. Give it to us. Okay. 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 We're going to figure it out. Yeah. We're going to figure it out. Yeah. Me and Raz, me and Carol are okay. back. Oh, good. Awesome. And Ramona is back. Oh, crazy yeah. Ramona. Yeah. And, you okay. know, Rob keeps that stuff close to the, you know, close to the 
the belt. So. Well, you guys were the ones who were invited to the party, yeah, so we, we knew that you were going to be there. Things yeah. like that. Yes. But yeah, we're, we're going to be back for the next season, and right. we're really excited. In my opinion, I think all the cast will be back. You know, I think it was a big stir up to, to bring three women on, mm -hmm. and it was a lot to get to know each other, really get to know one another. Sure. So I hope everybody will be back, and yes. uh, we'll get a, and hopefully maybe some new people. Well, new quickly faces. before you go, I just wanted to ask you about the legal battle right now that you're currently yes. in with Spanx. Yes. Can you give us an update on where you stand now? Well, I countersued her. So initially, Spanx sued me. So okay. I sent a cease okay. and desist because she was um, infringing on um, three or four of my 11 patents. Right, with with your yummy tummy with line. Yummy, yep, yes. the original mm -hmm. tank. And mm -hmm. so I sent privately a cease and desist because I wanted to, you know, settle the matter privately. Sure. And she blindsided me with a lawsuit. So I countersued her on Monday, and we're going to have to uh, let a jury decide, unfortunately. Gee. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's really silly. In my opinion, well, you adding know, that I'd much rather be focused on organ donation and yummy in yeah, the housewives than sure. worried about a legal battle. Spanx is over here. I'm over here. She should do her, and I'll do me. And Absolutely, we'll, we'll all be happy. <laughs> yeah, we'll yeah. keep us posted yeah. on yes. everything. And Thank Heather Thompson, you. thank you so much oh, for joining you guys. us. We keep it rocking on the couch. Oh yeah, you. definitely. <laughs> yeah. April's organ donation month, so it's yeah. a good time to get in gear and see how you can be a donor. Absolutely. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Now, would you guys like to have breakfast?